Oh, oh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I've got it. Where? It's not here. I'll keep it under my mattress. Do I look irresponsible? It's not there. Yeah, I know. Look, it's out there, right? It's seeing the world, exploring, it's making connections. You'll have it tomorrow. Thank you. Donald. Hey. Today, I, I really need it today. Why is it always about business? I thought we were friends. We are friends. We're, we're business friends, okay? Donald, an opportunity like this comes along once in a lifetime, I am telling you. You said that about that horse. Yeah, well, how am I supposed to know that what's his name in a heart condition? Thunderhoof. Yeah. Oof. Thunder, indeed. Look, Donald, it's really simple, okay? All we have to do is put our money down on this government land. Because if we don't, then it's going to revert to the Okijiwa tribe, okay? And they're going to be forced to put a casino on that land. And they don't want that to happen because it's going to spoil the rich cultural heritage they've been cultivating for thousands of years. Right? But if we can get our money down to this guy that I know at the county clerk's office, then we can take advantage of a loophole in zoning regulation 8675309. And then we'll have the land, and we lease it out to the people of the tribe, Chief Running Blossom. He builds a cultural learning annex on there, and we're all rich. I don't need more money, Jimmy. Donald, I know that a few grand inheritance is a big deal to you, but I'm talking about rich like buy a giraffe rich no no uh, i mean uh, money darkens the corridor to a content temperate soul right, donald where is your aunt's check i gave it to my club what why because money coats the soul in a cocoon of falsehood okay. well, what are you talking about all we need is just oh no crap all right donald you're my brother you're sick you have a stomach flu all right let's go we gotta get a Jimmy Adams. Hey. Son of a bitch. Leslie. Wow. Good to see you. We should catch up, but this is really bad timing you right You said now. that chiropractor's testimony would hold up in court. Oh, that sucks. It's so bad. We should catch up, but this is a Huge terrible time. My brother Donald here is so sick. Life. He's a stomach flu, right? Brother, and I'm sick. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, with a stomach, stomach flu. flu. And we have to go to a hospital. His insurance is only good oh. in Indiana, so we'll be there, oh. OK? It's good to see you. Wait, you gave your money to who, Donald? I, I told you. I gave it to my club. Oh, please, Donald. Because it's private and they probably already cashed my check already. Probably or just possibly. Jimmy, this club is very delicate. It's not a sex club, is it? I don't want to walk in there and see a bunch of people going at it. No, it's a calm place where you can learn about yourself in a serene atmosphere. It smells like ketchup in here. Shh, please. I'm trying to focus on my seven centers. They never heard of a heater, it's freezing. Darkness. Darkness breeds fear. Fear breeds apathy. Apathy breeds sadness and laziness. It is a family tree of shame. In this period of mourning, we are surrounded by darkness. Darkness. But there is a light. Our leader showed us the light. Our leader, may he rest in peace, illuminated our path with his glowing orbs of truth. And until his spirit returns, we need to stay on that path. Donald, I gotta get out of here. Good luck with this whole thing. Jimmy, wait, wait, this could help you. <sighs> Ooh. And remember to pay your dues. We have a memorial to pay off, and a heating bill.
<laughs> Thank you. We're going to turn the lights back up now. Thank you. Because I think it's time we nominated a pro tem facilitator in the leader's absence. And I have someone in mind. Donald. Yes, Annette. I was wondering what the leader would say about grieving. Ah, ah. Oh. Ah. I feel so strange. Oh. Oh, it's that urn. I'm strangely drawn to this, this urn. Calling me for some reason. Uh, put that down. What? No. What? Oh yes, no, I can hear you. Oh my yes. Gosh. Maybe he's on Bluetooth. <laughs> Give it back. What, Come your on. followers? Just... Oh, I, what do you want me to say to them? Oh, I can't. I, I'm, I'm just a, just a simple <laughs> man. I... <laughs> oh, no. Jimmy, Jimmy, are you all right? Did you see that? That was awesome. Give him some room. Oh. Oh. Oh, I saw someone. It was him. The leader? Was he taller? How dare you defy him? He said that money, he said that money darkens the corridor to a temperate, content soul. Oh my god. It does do that. It really does darken the corridor. It was him. Oh, he says that you all need a new guide. That's what I've been saying. Uh, oh, I can't believe it. The leader believes in me. No, so and, he... and he said that uh, Annette, here it is, uh -huh. Annette, right? She cannot be your leader because she is a, warm, a warrior. And, and we need her on the front lines. Did he say anything about me? My name's Paul. No. Uh, he wants me to. He said that he wants me to. Oh, are you sure? I, I don't know if I should tell him. Who's he talking to? The leader, jackass. Oh, he says he knows that you're doubtful, and that's okay. He knows you're in pain, but he also says it's time to hit pain before pain hits us. That was beautiful. Thanks. And familiar. He says, he says that I, I am your new leader. What? 